What is the function of Moby Dick? What does he tell us about Ahab? Anyone? Okay. Maybe his myopia, his obsession, maybe something. Maybe something to provide meaning in a in a in a society where there are no other options for him. What? I brought tacos. Why did you bring tacos? Because it's lunchtime. They better be crunchy. You know they are. What are you doing here? What am I doing anywhere? I want to see my sister. Sure, but see you Thursday, Dr. Piker. <laughs> what? Dr. Piker. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> How are Allie and Nina? They're fine. It's been two months, Cal. We haven't seen any of you in two months. Not since... I know. Why are you here? We should go on a trip. What? A trip, a vacation. The kind that involves getting on a plane in one place and getting off the plane in another place. Why? Because the plane's moved. <laughs> Why should we go on a trip? The Bigfoot Investigation Organization is pleased to invite you on a journey. <laughs> really, you didn't outgrow this when you were two. Come on. Join our professional experience guide in exploring the mystery of Bigfoot. Yep, one week camping. They take you all the way to Ape Canyon. Bigfoot. Use infrared goggles, you look for footprints. Bigfoot. We prefer the term Sasquatch. <laughs> um, I have a class, but we should talk later, okay? Bring the family. We'll have a barbecue. Gray got a new grill. He thinks he's gonna be manly. It's adorable. We'll talk later, yeah? Suppose I already got the tickets. Cal? Suppose I got two. Bring your wife. Suppose I used your credit card. What? Well, how, how did you get you my- Give me the number after mom. And I took care of everything, Sam. You know I did. That's not okay. I know. And I'm so sorry. But you owe me, and this is what I want. You don't have to go, you know. You could stay here with me. We can hang out. We can, uh, we can build forts. <laughs> what? <laughs> Tally asked about it last night. It sounded fun. He's not your responsibility, you know. He's got to be someone's. That's what wives are for. Oh, is that how that works? Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> we are building forts when you get back. We'd better.
What's that? That, my friend, is Bigfoot. What's Bigfoot? Oh, well, Bigfoot is a really, really big, really, really hairy ape that walks on two legs and lives in the woods. Are his feet big? Oh, huge. Is he real? Of course he's real. Do you think I could try him if he wasn't real? <laughs> so you were going to the bathroom. I was just looking. Sleep well? Mm. Did you have a nice flight? Mm-hmm. You're gonna be like this the whole time? Decent chance. Well, you'll feel better once we see a Bigfoot. We're not gonna see Bigfoot. People see Bigfoot every year, so why not us? We're not gonna see Bigfoot. We saw Mothman. No, you saw a barn owl out the window when you told me it was Mothman. Right. I still have nightmares, you know. Well, seeing Bigfoot will fix all that. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Hey there. Hey there yourself. Franklin Tunney, Bigfoot Investigation Organization. Cal Piker, this is Sam. Sam is super excited. I'm super excited, too. Come along. You guys are the last. Charlie Siegel. You uh, here with your family? They're not my family. Harsh. You're a little young to be out here on your own. It's my money. Mom said it's my bar mitzvah money and I can do whatever I want with it. Yeah? And I want to see Bigfoot. It's exciting, right? Oh, oh, no, that's, that's, uh, that's not excitement. You were dragged along, weren't you? Oh, I can tell, you were dragged along. Oh, you were dragged along. Yeah, pretty much. Boyfriend? Brother. Little brother. He means well, he just, he means well. But you know, it's not gonna be bad. It's gonna You'll see. I've never been camping. Well, no, I think, I think I've been camping like once. It's like seven. But it, was, it really was a good experience, you know, and the tent fell down. And there was a raccoon. He was not a nice raccoon. I always wanted to go again, though. Like, you know, in the woods. <laughs> Mark, like, lives. Dating? seven weeks <laughs> and Bigfoot already. I mean, it seemed fun, you know? And Mark thought it would be great if we got a professional being as though it was my first time out and all. <laughs> Isn't he great? Everybody out. 
Grab your bags, grab your gear, grab your water, all right? <sighs> Fresh mountain air, man. Nothing like it. You know it. Hey, that's a nice compass. His grandfather gave it to him. Oh, yeah? First time he took me out. Look me right in the eyes, you said, as long as you have this compass, you'll always find your way. And I have. <laughs> oh, Mark! Um, sir? Yeah? I thought we were going to Ape Canyon. We are, my friend, but not in this. It stays here. Ape Canyon's through there. We will hike. We're going to sleep under the blanket of Mother Nature herself. And if we're lucky, people, might just see something remarkable. Something remarkable. Let's move out. And you see this pencil? My grandfather gave me this pencil. He looked me in the eyes and said, as long as you carry this with you, you'll always find your way. And all of the wonders stand between. I don't wanna be another mystery, you know. I don't wanna see who's looking at me, oh no. I wanna be the one to feel the sun, oh, oh. So if you wanna see the world with me, let's go. The alligator, the guy that made her, and all the creatures. I got left behind in Mycenae, Ave Maria And everything you gotta take hard to find I don't wanna be a vapor of heavenly light Everybody guess if I'm an angel of sprite I don't wanna be another mystery, oh no I don't wanna see who's looking at me, oh no You're pissed. I can always tell when you're pissed. You get that far away sort of psycho, let's stab a kitten look in your eyes. I'm not gonna stab a kitten. Oh, do you remember Meowsers? I didn't even know she was there. Oh, okay. God. I'm, I'm not pissed. I'm annoyed. Annoyed? You could have asked. I like to spend my breaks with Gray and the kids. You know that. It's not like we didn't have plans. What plans? Well, not in a forest in Oregon. Looking for some monkey anyone with half a brain can tell you isn't even there to find. I think you're being unrealistic. Y you think I'm being unrealistic? Completely. There's 400 recorded Bigfoot sightings every year. And I'm not talking about stone teenagers and mountain men. 400 people. That's young and old, rich and poor, dumb and super smart. All kinds of people, okay? Cal. So I'm as close to it as we are to Charlie right now. Hey, Charlie. What? There's footprints with actual dermal ridges like fingerprints. There's footage that any real scientific analysis proves could not have been faked. And the recordings. Thank you, Charlie. Yes, whistles, hoots, howls, audio recordings, it's been proven, could not have come from any known creature in this country. Okay, so how can you know all that and still not believe there's something well, out but there? But why here? Why Ape Canyon? There are all kinds of people who see these things, see them anywhere. But Ape Canyon... Ape Canyon what? That's where they are. So who knows the story of Ape Canyon? <sighs> An adventure, my friends, is no good without a destination. And a destination means nothing if we fail to understand the journey. The year was 1924 across the plains of Abraham by Mount St. Helens. A prospector named Fred Beck and his miners 
Sought their fortune in gold. It was late in the day when Fred and one of his miners ventured out in the forest to collect some water from a nearby spring. Something moved across the canyon. Something big. The miner fired. But it was gone. The sky was dark and the hour was late that night when it began. The attack was relentless. Through the night, they fought to defend themselves, Fred and his team, from such creatures as they had never before imagined. When dawn came, they ran and they never went back. That canyon became known as Ape Canyon. Fred Beck's story went down as legend. Those of us who studied it, those of us who explored these woods, know that every single word is absolutely true. Let's get us some sleep. We got a big day tomorrow. Oh, oh I am seriously jet lagged. Mm. Charlie, are you jet lagged? I'm from San Diego. Cause who am I jet lagged? Night, man. Hey, Cal. This can be fun. I mean, I know you're really excited. I don't want to make you feel like... I don't want to be the reason that you don't have... It's cool. Good day tomorrow? Good day. see if my stuff's still here. You checked my bag first? Cal? Cal! Huh? Cal, what's going on? Where's Franklin, Cal? Okay. Promise you won't get mad. Sam! Hey, Sam! Sam, look! I... <laughs> You're telling me our guide snuck into our tents in the middle of the night and took everything we have and, and no one saw a thing? Well, uh, the general theory is that uh, in the beans, which Gina says he wasn't eating, he, uh... He drugged us? It's a working theory. You took me on a trip into the middle of the woods where a strange man snuck into our tents after he drugged us? Theory? Oh, he could have oh, done things. Well, I mean, he probably did. I mean, who wouldn't, right? Okay, not the time. Uh, look, I, I didn't... You didn't think. <laughs> you didn't research. You bought the tickets with my credit card, which he has. I didn't know that. And he took my phone. He, 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 he took my phone. I can't cancel the... Sam, it'll be okay. God damn it. What do we do, Cal? What's the plan? I mean, sit back, kick our feet up, and hope that Franklin, or whatever his name is, is nice enough to send someone to find us once he's safe in Mexico or wherever... Canada. What? Uh... Canada? I mean, if he's leaving the country, it makes a lot more sense for him to go to Canada, you know? Because geographically, it's, uh... It's closer. Look. You're right, okay. I, I screwed up. I really screwed this up. I, I am so sorry. sorry. I know. You're always sorry. 
don't know how Allie puts up with you. It's a mystery. Do we have food? Cal, we have to save it. We have, I have plenty. It's all good. It's got whole grain. Hmm? We love whole grain. I'm still very mad. I know. What are we gonna do? Mark! He has a compass. Yes, he was looking at it the whole time. Mark. Can you get can us to Ape Canyon? Are you serious? What? Come on, Ape Canyon, that's the whole point. We're gonna pack it in after the first little sign of Our trouble. Our guy robbed us and left us in the woods to die. Yeah, like an hour ago. I can't believe we're having this conversation. You can't get us there, right, Mark? Well, uh, um... There aren't signs, Cal. This isn't a road, this is a forest. There are trees. Yeah, he has a compass. A compass is not a GPS. Yes, it is. Actually. You can get us back to the road, right? No, but we're going to Ape Canyon. That's the whole point. Mark, can you do it? Well, um... <laughs> Mark can definitely do it. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Uh, you know, we came on a northwest bearing. If we just no, turn yeah, around. No, we're not going to the road. Yes, we are. Okay, anyone else other than Sam who wants to give up and go home, raise your hand. Oh, that's an option. Got <laughs> it. I'm sorry. About what? I wanted to go to Ape Canyon, too. Yeah, you know, it's a little late, kid. I'm a man. She's really mad is all. I didn't want her to yell at me. Yeah, well, welcome to my childhood. But I'm looking really hard. And if I see a Bigfoot, I'll totally let you know. Appreciate that. You know the Salish Indians? They used to talk about giants. The Aztec Linoans, too. They called them N. Numic and Soa Peets, and they said they lived in caves. Uh, yeah, there were tree ones, too, right? Yeah, but the Lakotas were even better. They said, talked about a messenger, right? Who showed up in evil times? Well, they said sometimes he was fire, but sometimes he was a huge, hairy man. And all the other tribes knew about the same messenger. Yeah, the big, hairy one. Well, sometimes he's fire. That's how you know they're real, you know? Because why would they have all these stories if Bigfoots weren't real? I told Nina once about the tree men before bed. She said I was making it up. I told her I'd prove it to her someday. Is that why you want to go to Ape Canyon? That's where they are. Hey, Mark. How long do you think? Oh, well, it was a long hike out here. But we're getting there. Just want to get back before the weather gets bad. Uh, we'll be all right. He's following our tracks. Tracks? <laughs> I know it looks like dirt, grass, and leaves. But when you're out here enough, you start to see the imprints, the patterns, you know, the bend of a blade of grass, the turn of a leaf, and I can see clearly five sets of footprints going back that way. There were six of us. Exactly. Six. Exactly. Hey, you okay? Oh, gotcha. Uh, hey, break. How many of these do we have? Plenty.
then, when the 1920s happened and you have Art Deco with uses of geometry and chrome and the Chrysler building with massive immortal P and to hope and optimism, I mean. <laughs> and that's why I'm gonna make buildings. And they're gonna be super awesome buildings and they're gonna stand and last forever. Right? I mean, like, forever? <laughs> you think that's something? You should hear Sam nerd rant on Herman Melville. I do not nerd rant on Herman Melville. Please, you got your doctorate in nerd ranting on Herman Melville. I got my doctorate in English literature. It's the same thing. She used to have a poster of Melville on her wall. Come on. Naked. <laughs> nice. I did not. <laughs> um, I think we have a problem. You've gotta be kidding. What the hell is this, Mark? Well, um... Uh, Mark? You guys don't think... No, guys, guys, this, this is not our campsite. All right, I know it oh. looks like our campsite, but yeah. all campsites look the same at first. It's only after you spend as much time out in the woods as I hey, have. Hey, that's my pencil. Yes, it certainly looks like your pencil, but... No, this I... is totally my pencil. See, look, guys, it's the same color and everything. <laughs> okay, what, what's going on? <clears throat> Chipmunks. Chipmunks? Chipmunks like pencils. They like to move pencils from one campsite to another campsite that looks like the first campsite. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god! Okay, I can explain. Look, your profile said you liked outdoorsy guys, and, and, and I really wanted to meet you, so, so, so... Are you serious? So I, I, I read up and I, I learned how to pitch a tent. It turned out to be a lot of fun. Your grandfather's compass! All that shit about your grandfather's compass! Yes, yes. No, uh, Walmart, actually. No, I used hydrogen peroxide and acid and, and made it worn and, and rusty, and I'm a bit of a chemistry nut. It, it's kind of my thing. But my name is Mark. You son of a bitch. Walmart! You goddamn shitbook! Hey, Cal. Mind lending a hand? Maybe you can block the wind so I can get this going. Block the wind? Well, yeah, just stand in front oh, of me. I don't the think that's gonna work. Well, it pretty much has to work, doesn't it? Hey, it's gonna be okay. Right. Seriously, all right? Everything is gonna be fine. You don't get to do that. Everything's not gonna be fine just because you say it is. You don't get to bumble into other people's lives, fuck things up, and then say everything's gonna be fine. Hey, Cal. Uh, I was wondering if maybe I could, um... Gina doesn't want me sleeping in the tent with her, so I just thought I might be able to, if you didn't mind... I don't know, ma'am. Charlie. Yeah, okay. Just... Forget it, Mark, okay? Sam. Do you mind? No, it's fine. Jesus.
<laughs> Sam! Sam? Sam! You okay? What the hell is wrong with you? I... Where did you go, I, huh? I, I thought... What did you think? I, I thought I heard Bigfoot. Come on, we need to get back to camp. Which way? Gina? Charlie? Sam. We'll find them. We shouldn't have to find them. We should be with them in our tents, sleeping. I know. I didn't mean to. Oh, you didn't mean to. You didn't think. You never think, Cal. You just screw things up for everyone else. Hey, I'm not a complete screw up. I did plan mom's. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And you screwed that up, too. The flowers were supposed to be mom's favorite. Baby's breath. I told you. You can't even. Oh. Hey, hey, come on. Sit down. What are you doing? Sit down. Cal, we have to find them. It's... And we will. Come on. Oh, don't. It's warm. I'm warm. Oh, you're freezing. Yeah, well, I'll get warmer. It's a gift. Come on. Come on. All right. All right. Okay. Oh. Okay. Yeah, come in. <clears throat> Making yourself at home? Mm-hmm. I talked with the sergeant. He said they should be able to get us on a flight home tomorrow. They just have to sort things out with TSA. Mm-hmm. Kind of hard to get a flight when you don't have money or ID, but he says it's not the first time someone's lost their things in the woods. Mm-hmm. Look, Cal, the things I said... Forget it. I just... It... It's all good. What are you doing? Packing, and you should too. Packing? Yeah. It's a long way from here to Ape Canyon. Cal, we're not going to Ape Canyon. We're going home. I can't find Bigfoot at home. after everything we went through out there? We probably only need the one bag. We can just take turns carrying it. We're lucky we're not sick. We're lucky we're not dead. Okay, fine, I'll carry it. Are you insane? 
Come on, this is the whole point. Near Death Experiences, Crazy Adventure, the Biker Action Squad, together again. We were never called that. No one ever called us that or anything remotely like it. You know what? I'm gonna give you a moment. You go upstairs, grab your stuff, I'll meet you out front, and we'll go. We're not going back out there. We're not. I guess not, right? That makes sense. That's okay. What do I tell Allie and Nina when I come home without you? Tell them I said hi. Cal! Look, I get it, okay? You didn't want to come on this trip in the first place. Dumb idea, stupid cow, right? But we came here to find Bigfoot, and I'm not giving up. Idiots see Bigfoot back home, too. Well, that's not where they are. Fly home. Buy another tent. That's not, that's not where they are. And take your are. daughter camping that's like a normal human. That's not where they are. It's not where they are. They're in a canyon. I... Look. Give Gray my best. Whatever the hell that's worth. Wait, 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 wait. One second. Let me, let me check with the sergeant. I mean, maybe he can help you. One minute. Riding your stupid car anyway. Hi. Hey, Charlie. You gonna follow me along? Kinda. You are stealthier than I thought. Come along. Keep doing that. Eh, uh, anti-Semitism. Probably. Is there a trick? What, like a, like a hitchhiking trick? Yeah. Well, I mean, you gotta work the thumb. I'm working the thumb. Okay, well then you gotta show a little leg. So were they pissed? What? Parents, when you called with the whole getting conned and left in the woods to die thing. Yes. Dad said I was chasing unicorns. Unicorns? Yeah, because Bigfoot, he doesn't even know. He thinks they're the same thing. Did he say that just to piss you off? Yeah. He's so full of shit. Probably. Most of us are. It's like he's not even trying. Howdy. Where to? On St. Helens? Well, I can uh, take you as far as Winlock. I don't know where that is. It's closer than here. Perfect. Darwin, Keen. Cal, and uh, this is Charlie. Pleasure. Everybody in? Wyabe Canyon. What do you mean? Well, there's lots of places for camping. Some a fuck ton closer than Mount St. Helens. So Wyabe Canyon. Disney was closed. We're here to see Bigfoot. <laughs> Should have figured. Yeah, we get all kinds of guys like you up here. Tourists mostly. Hikers, heads higher than the redwoods. Let me tell you something that's gonna save you all kinds of time, okay? Ain't no such thing as Bigfoot. Just a bunch of stupid ass hicks and stupid ass costumes just trying to scare the hell out of everybody. Now, I will most certainly take you to Winlock, all right? And Abe Canyon is beautiful country if you make it out that far. 
But you ain't gonna find no hairy mountain man, I can tell you that much. It's where they are. They ain't anywhere. Do you ever see that, that film from back in the 70s, the grainy one, shows the Bigfoot kind of walking through the woods, and stops and turns, looks at the camera? The Patterson-Gimlin film. Yeah, that's the one. Thing is, my pop, he knew the guy in the costume. Yeah. Bunch of fools out there still want to buy it. Fools want to get fooled, that's their business. But if you ask me... Well, nobody asked you. Excuse me? Hey, Darwin. Hey, Kirk. Who's your guest? Bigfoot hunters. Oh, yeah? Hey, check out the star. Got a real good one for you. <laughs> Serious stick up his ass. Hey, you telling me. Okay, you know what? Do you know how many different guys have claimed to be in that costume? Huh? Three, four guys, all swearing to be the guy in a costume that couldn't even been made in 1967. Now, which one did your pop know? Just settle down, kid. No, no, no. I want to know. How did he make it, huh? How did he simulate the muscle movement? Why did he add the breasts? You might want to step off now. Hey, hey, Cal. How long did he practice the movement for, huh? How, how did he manage the, the face? I'm sorry if I poked a hole in your little world, OK? But the only folks stupid enough to believe that shit are tourists and hicks. Hicks? <laughs> and what are you? Hmm? I'm an educated man with a college degree, you city-fied sack of shit. Yeah, and what? Nuclear physics. Wait, what? Really? Yeah. Okay, well, you know what? Doesn't matter anyway, because there was no costume. It's been proven. My pop knew the guy in the suit! Well, your pop don't know shit! Yeah. Sorry about that. dream and you were there and you were there and oh you were there and oh you were there and oh you were definitely there you're probably still dreaming man damn it Terrific. This has been a really proud day for me. <sighs> Why is Ape Canyon where they are? Well, with bedside manner like that, you really should have pursued a medical career. Why is Ape Canyon where they are? I don't know. Climate? You're the professor. Charlie said you were saying that all the way to the hospital. Well, I have no recollection of this. I think not. You hit your head pretty hard. No, an enormous nuclear physicist in my head pretty hard. So, where are we, anyway? Longview, just a bit north of the border. What, Canadian? Washingtonian. Ah, perfect. You're not doing it. To what? Heading out there again. You have a concussion! People keep saying that, but I'm really just like this. I'm serious. I can tell you got your serious face on. Cal? Okay, I hear you. All right, Ape Canyon is a five-hour drive from the airport, and in three days, I haven't made any further than an ER in Longview. Okay, the universe is sending some pretty strong signals here. It's not forever, you know? It, it's a rain check. We'll head out in the summer, we'll bring the families, we'll make a vacation of it, okay? 
One condition. What? Chips. I got knocked out in a convenience store, and I never got my chips. Got it. You remember the hierarchy, right? Ketchup, plain, sour cream, honey barbecue, regular barbecue. I'm your brother, your brother. The, 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 I, I resent the insinuation that you would even consider. Oh, hey. <laughs> hey, pass me a screwdriver. What? Just kidding, I know you don't have a screwdriver. What's wrong with you? I'm fine. You're not fine. You haven't been fine since the second you showed up outside my classroom. <sighs> what is we having a heart to heart? This is a special moment. Come on. What, do you need a hug? Why is Ape Canyon where they are? Mom said something to me a few years ago. She said, not since your father have I known a boy to run so hard and so fast in entirely the wrong direction. Oh, I never knew dad, Mom, did I? <laughs> Mom said that Well, you... Mom's dead, Sam. Say the words. <laughs> uh, yes. you, you can still go back inside. But you, you wandered away. You, you have a concussion. Oh. We can do this. No, we can't. Adventure is calling. It's doing no such thing. But the road is our highway. What does that even mean? Sam. Sam. What? Do you trust me? No. Oh, well. <sighs> I have a concussion. Come on. What can I... I didn't do anything. Come back. Damn it. Damn it. What were you thinking, Cal? What the hell were you thinking? They're gonna fire me, you know that? Or suspend me at least until the charges can... <laughs> oh, charges. <laughs> How do I explain this, huh? Why did I get into the car? Why didn't I tell the hospital as soon as I saw that you were gone? Why didn't I do that? The students. My students, oh God, they'll, they'll hear about it and, and I won't be there and and they'll all wonder where Dr. Piker is, and, 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 and I won't be able to tell them. And, oh, God, I'm done. I can't, I can't go back there. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What is funny? <laughs> Dr. Piker. You asshole, you asshole! Do you even get it, huh? Do you even care? What was the point of this? Dragging me out here, robbed, arrested, conned. What the hell was the point? Bigfoot. There is no Bigfoot. There is no Bigfoot. There is no Bigfoot. There's only you, Cal. You're the only monster here. Damn it. I need to call Gray. I need to call the kids. Hey, hey, I get a phone call. I want my phone call. It's late, they're asleep. What do I even tell them? <laughs> you want to know the funny thing? I thought you'd grown up. I really did. Nina came along and you stepped up. And then when mom... But you're the same kid who killed three mice you forgot to feed. You're the same kid who ran the station wagon into Gunpowder River. You're the same kid who didn't even care to try to replace the clarinet reed you broke. 
I really don't know how Allie puts up with you. Allie's gone. What? Allie's gone, Sam Nina, too. Gone? What, what do you mean, gone? Gone where? Away. Oh, no. When? Nine days and five hours. What? Did... Did she say anything? Did she... Is she... Why? Why? Seriously? Why do you think? I'm the monster. I scared them away. No, no Cal. I didn't mean it. No, why not? You were right. You know it. Mom knew it. I had Allie fooled for a while, but she was always going to figure it out. Because I fuck up. I fuck up. It's what I do. It's not. Don't lie to me, Sam. You took care of everything. And Mom, when she died, I, I couldn't do it. You took care of everything. See, I screwed that up, too. Because the flowers. I got the wrong flowers. And you know what? She wouldn't even have been upset. She would have been way too used to it to even be upset. Find Bigfoot. Bigfoot isn't real. He has to be. You've got to be kidding. Franklin. Hey, hey it's you guys. Hey, we're all friends. Oh, we're not friends. This guy conned us. He left us in the woods to die. Oh, you didn't die, did you? Yes. Thank you, sir. You are a good and honorable man. Whatever. Shouldn't you be in Canada or somewhere not here? That's what I do. I dawdle, I spend. It's my vice. Spend. Don't worry, I haven't gotten to your stuff yet. The kid, loaded. You ruined it. Ruined what? Ape Canyon. OK, how did I ruin Ape Canyon? What, because we didn't get there? Because we didn't reach the cryptozoological mecca? It's just a place, man. Special sure to those people who wanted to be that. But it's just a place. What are you guys in for, anyway? Stole a car. <laughs> Stole a car. <laughs> you know, they will put you on a flight home. To get to Ape Canyon. Really? Look, if it's any consolation, the place is real. The story is true. Those of us who explored these woods know that every single word of it is absolutely true. Hell, maybe it is. Why not? Bigfoot, weirder things, right? Be quiet. Haven't you done enough? Sorry. Yes, Virginia, there is a Bigfoot. Go to hell. All right. As much as I'm enjoying all this judgment, I do have some place to be. There it is. Woohoo! That was a close one for a few minutes, huh? Oh, hey, do me a favor. Tell the kid I'm sorry. Hey, make it sound sincere, okay? you make it. I really do. Hey, 
Hey, wait. Come on. Sam. Let's go. What are we doing? Leaving. Yeah, but we don't have to. You I don't know, have to. I know. Look, it was my idea. I'll tell them that. The car breaking out of the cell, just to screw up brother screwing up again. I... And you'll get to go home. Come on. Haven't I fucked up your life enough already? <laughs> Here they come. They're coming, Sam. Come on. This is so stupid. You know it is. Come on. You don't have to run. We're not running. Then what are we doing? We're going to Ape Canyon. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, and there are several perfectly valid ways to handle this situation. Run! <sighs> They'll call Park Rangers, probably. But I think we have some time before they get in touch with state troopers, figure out it's us. We need to get some distance, figure out which direction we should be going in. You have the map, Cal? Cal. We're almost there. Why didn't mom ever take us camping? Mom? Yeah. Camping. It would have helped prepare us for situations just like these. <laughs> I don't think mom could have navigated the backyard. You remember the corn maze in Lutherville? Oh my god, yes. <laughs> we decided to go our own several ways, see who could make it out first. Uh, let's see, it was you, then me. And then two hours later, mom and the Baltimore County Police Department. <laughs> <laughs> god. How old were we? Oh, I think I was like nine. You were nine, because your birthday was like a week away and you wouldn't shut up about being 10. Yeah, hey, 10's a big deal, okay? You get that second digit and the whole world makes sense. And you still won't shut up about it. I'm sorry. Yeah, we covered that. No, about what I said with mom. It's okay. I was an asshole. <laughs> yes, you were. And it's okay. No, I, it's stupid. I was stupid. You saved me. What? I was lost. I couldn't do it. And you were there. Yeah, but I mean, I screwed up the flowers. You think she'd have cared? The flowers, Cal, really? Charlie said there might be caves. Sleep here for the night. I think so. <coughs> you okay? to understand. Help me. We, we, they, they take us camping all, all the way to, and we, we, we use infrared goggles. That's we look not, that's not, for footprints. That's not the point. We. I know it's been hard since your mom. I know. But that, that was next semester. That was rent. That was... Talk to me. 
dying. Uh, I can't do this. I can't. It's like you're not even trying. Mommy? Nina. Nina. What's wrong? <sighs> nothing, nothing. Did you fall? No, no, I'm not. Nina? Nina, can you go up, up to your room and pick out some clothes for me? Pretty clothes? Only the prettiest. We can find them. We can, we can find them, and then, and then, and then everything will be all right. No, no, no. We know where they are. Cal. You better move. Nobody's found us yet. Doesn't mean they won't. Maybe we can stop at a creek and refill our. I didn't use your credit card. For the trip, I lied when I said I did. Why? I didn't. I didn't think you'd come with me. I didn't think I could make it without you. Whatever, forget it. Let's just get there. Okay. Are we close? Are we going the right way? I don't know. Well, where does it say we are on the... It's not a GPS. It's a map. We're in the middle of the goddamn woods. That's where we are. If we started where I think we started, this should be the right direction. Sam, I'm... Don't. I'm gonna climb the tree. What? What are you doing? I told you, I'm climbing the tree. Why? Vantage point. Gonna see what I can see. Maybe see if anything fits the map. Do you see anything? Lots of trees. Do you see a campground? Uh... No. Uh, maybe? I, I see a lot of orange. So it could be like a tent. Is that good? Oh, Cal. Yeah, that's definitely a tent. Why do they have a better tent than me? Yeah, see him. Uh, Sam? Well, what is it? What do you see? Sam, Sam. What, 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 what? Move. What, what? Okay, Sam, okay, we've... Christ, Cal, are you okay? We've gotta go. Well, what, what? The ranger, just... he saw me. How close? I, I don't know. Well, was he alone? I don't know, I don't know. We need to get to Ape Canyon. Well, I... Which way is it? Well, I don't, I don't know. Okay, well, if the campground was here from where I was looking. Uh, um, maybe? I was gonna hey, slow down. We need to get to Ape Canyon. Oh. I'm not sure this is right. You said this was the way. I said I didn't know. They're looking for us. I know. We just need to get there. I know. We're almost there. I know. We just... No. Calvin and Samantha Piker, I'm going to need you to come with me. We're almost there. We're, we're almost there. Sir, look, we just... Look, we, we just need to make it to Ape Cannon, okay? Sir. Look, we just... look, we, 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 just, we just need to make it to Ape Cannon, okay? Sir. Just a little bit further, and, and then we'll go with you, I swear. I can't let you do that. Please. I found him. Two clicks. Hey! Oh, don't, don't, don't! No, 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 Cal? I'm almost there. Cal? I'm almost there, almost there. We are there, look, we made it. It's bullshit! We have to get to Ape Canyon. Cal? We have to get to Ape Canyon. We don't have to keep... Where they are! It's where I need to be. Cal! Let me go! No! Let me go! No. We're not here. 
here. They're not here. It won't bring them back. We made it. We made it. Hold them until tomorrow. They'll probably be transferred to a larger facility. At least it was me. I stole the car. I broke out of the cell. Well, like I said, charges can be no. filed. No. She was just protecting me. She was just looking out for me. She's my sister. He said they're probably gonna send me home. You don't have to do this. The breakout, the van. It was me. I did it. You had nothing to do with it. It was all me, okay? Allie and Nina. I know. I know. Get off the catwalk, I want you to talk, to be the seer, instead of the scene. There is a flower, a leaning tower, and all of the wonders stand in between. I don't wanna be another mystery, oh no. I don't wanna see who's looking at me, oh no. I wanna be the one to feel the sun, oh no. Oh. So if you want to see the world with me, let's go. The alligator, the god that made her, and all the creatures that got left behind. And my Zania, Ave Maria, and everything you gotta take hard to find. I don't want to be a vapor of heavenly light. Everybody guess if I'm an angel of sprite I don't wanna be another
the mystery, oh no I don't want to see who's looking at me, oh no I want to be the one to feel the sun, oh no oh. So if you want to see the world with me, let's go You could pursue it, hell I could do it I'll just be quiet when I get angry and hurt I'm stopping traffic, cinemagraphic With my long black coat hanging down in the dirt in my hair Clinging to my face in the rain like a goddess from the coat of beautiful pain I don't want to be another mystery I don't want to be another mystery I could cut you off with a shoulder of stone Smoke all night and leave the party alone Screw myself with an inscrutable power But I just want you to come figure me out I don't want to be another mystery oh, no. I don't want to see who's looking at me Oh no I want to be the one to feel the sun Oh no oh. So if you wanna see the world with me, let's go.